Hey guys, so for today I'm going to be showing you how I pack my makeup and my toiletries, so kind of like my beauty essentials. So we're in my bathroom right now and I just thought I would show you guys what I'm bringing with me because a lot of you guys wanted me to do a pack with me video. So I really hope the echo isn't too bad in here. I wonder if I close this. Oh no, that's messy. So I hope that go isn't too bad in here, but I just have this really big bag. I got this from TJ Maxx a few months ago. Usually when I'm flying as a flight attendant, I like to bring my e-bags packing um, travel bag. And this is what it looks like. And this thing is awesome, but since I'm going to be gone for six weeks, I need a lot more room than this has. But um, when I start flying again, if you guys want me to do a what's my toiletry bag, I will definitely do that for you because I love this thing. So I'm going to try and fit everything in here. I might have to use another bag, but hopefully not. So first and foremost, I always have to have a certain type of conditioner just because I find that my hair comes out the softest and it's great if you have extensions. And that is the Joyco Moisture Recovery. Okay, so I already packed a few things in the front here. Just some essentials. I just put a few of these little Kleenexes. Um, just in case and then I packed a bunch of emergency. I feel like emergency is essential for flight attendant training because you don't want to be getting sick. You're not really on the best sleep schedule because you're like study, study, study. Oh, and the next thing I'm bringing is a razor and this is my favorite razor. This is the only razor I can use. It is the Intuition razor and um, I have really sensitive skin and usually like if I just use a regular razor, I'll have like scratch marks all up and down my leg is not a cute situation. Then I'm bringing with me some of my daily vitamins. I have a really big bottle here, but um, I decided to get the small bottle and these are the gummy version because that is the only way I know I will eat, or it's the only way I know I will take my vitamins. And I bought a fresh makeup wipe. I've never tried these before. These are the Aveeno Ultra Calming. I liked the flap lid just so that they don't dry out because usually I like to use these ones. These are by Neutrogena, um, but they don't have a good closing lid, so I have to keep them in a baggie, so I'm trying these ones out. And then I'm just bringing deodorant, of course, how fun is this? This is the Dove Advance Care Invisible 100. Bringing some Q-tips with me. I'm bringing a lip balm. This is the Lipsil Lip Balm. I'm picking up a new one of these today, but this is my favorite acne treatment, but I'm almost out of it, so I need to get another one. And then I'm bringing my Elemis Pro Collagen Marine Oil. I love this stuff for hydrating the skin. And then I'm bringing the Serious Skincare Serious C Restore Night Cream. Then I was sent this really neat box. This is from Pinch Me, and there's some stuff in here that I thought would be really fun to bring. It comes with this Olay Luminous Whip Moisturizer. So it says tone and pore perfecting results. So I'm gonna try this out tonight and see if I like it, because then I'm gonna bring this one with me. And then it just comes with some little bars that I'm actually gonna throw in on my carry-on, like little nut thins. I love these. Um, and I tried this today on my brushes. I just cleaned my brushes and I really liked it. Oh my gosh guys, this smell is so good. So I'm bringing, I'm just going to throw this in my shower. I'm not bringing it with. I just want to show you this in here. And then it has the conditioner, some more bars and this toothpaste and I'm bringing this with. This is the Dr. Sheffield's natural extra whitening toothpaste. So I'm bringing this with me. It's a monthly subscription box. If you guys are interested, I'll leave more information down below, but that came with some really good full size products. Then I'm bringing my toothbrush with me. I use an electric toothbrush, but the kit to like charge it is way too big for me to bring with. So I've been wanting to purchase the travel size Clarisonic for quite some time now because you know when you're flying all day, like stuff just gets into your skin and you want to be able to cleanse it really well at night, especially since I wear makeup. So I got the Clarisonic Mia Fit. I got the white one and I am obsessed with this thing. Oh my gosh, it is the perfect travel size. And let me show you it. It is so small and so stinking cute. And then it comes with the charger and it just sits right on there. Um, so the charger isn't a big deal to bring. 
so I'm gonna bring this with me too and what I love about this is Clarisonics are so good for your skin they are so good at like getting deep in to there and cleaning stuff out if you look at the videos at you just washing your face on its own versus using the Clarisonic you see how much more gunk it gets out of there it's kind of gross what will sit in your skin after wearing makeup all day so this is essential for me and I've also been trying out some different brush sets from Clarisonic I always used the sensitive skin one but I wanted to venture out so I've been trying all of them the only one I haven't tried yet is the enlarged pores one so this is the only one I haven't tried so I was talking with wonderfully Allie and trolley dolly about this brush head it is a makeup brush head they're also fly attendant youtubers by the way if you haven't checked them out go check out their channels I'll leave it listed below but this is a Clarisonic makeup brush head. This is just what it looks like, and this is the packaging. Oh my gosh, guys, I am like a beauty blender fanatic, but this, this is amazing. Like the way that it just like makes your foundation go on so seamlessly and you don't have to use that much product. I was really impressed with this. And the other two are the Radiance brush head, which is my favorite now. I love this thing because it's not too harsh on your skin and it just gives your skin a nice glow. And then the blemish skin one, I really, really like. So I'm gonna bring these two with me to training. Just for reference, I want to show you guys the size difference. So this one's great for travel and this one has an extra speed for those of you who know about the clarisonic it like beep beeps when you move to a different section of your face and it has an extra timer on it to like go into your neck which is great because it's great for wrinkles too and it gets off all the foundation that you should be blending in down here if you're not you should be and it's just amazing so i'm packing this with me what else do i need toothbrush toothpaste makeup remover face wash i kind of like go in order of how i do stuff so I recently got this Viore baking soda face wash, so I'm just bringing this with me, and it has like a locking pump, so I don't have to worry about it spilling. And I know I'm bringing a lot of full size stuff, but I'm gonna be gone for six weeks, guys. It's a long time. So that daily moisturizer. I'm going to bring my Tatcha Balance Pore Perfecting Water Gel Moisturizer. This is my favorite moisturizer, so I'm going to bring this with me for during the day moisturizer deodorant body wash i'm just gonna bring a bar of soap i have to pick one up at target today i thought i had an extra though so i'm kind of confused on what happened to that um but i just get the dove bar of soap sensitive skin no scent that's my jam um soap body lotion so i am bringing my vanilla bean noel from bath and body works i have made a heavy dent in this since the last time i talked to you guys about it and then I'm going to be bringing my water flosser with me. I just Instagram chatted you guys about this and I am loving it. I tried reaching out to the company to get you guys a discount code in case you wanted it, but I haven't heard back. Um, but I just bought this off Amazon. I'll leave it listed below. And this thing is awesome. So I went to the dentist recently and they told me I really need to start flossing because I'm so bad at flossing. I know it's so good for you. It adds seven years to your life, blah, 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 blah. But like I just... I can't get myself to do it but then I got this and it makes life so much easier and I feel like it almost does a better job than regular flossing I might have just made that up who knows but I'm bringing my water flosser with me okay so then for my hair products I am just going to bring a few I'm bringing the Tresemme hairspray I'm bringing my it's a 10 miracle leave-in plus keratin I don't use this every day I use it once in a blue moon um, so I'm bringing that and then this is the Tony Odisho Ostia Collection 3-in-1 Mist. I got this from the girl who does my hair extensions. Her information is down below. And then the one and only Argon Oil Treatment. And I get this from Sally's. And then I am bringing a huge bottle of dry shampoo because I go through this like it's nobody's business. And this is the one hair thing that I cannot live without. So I'm just going to put all that stuff in a Ziploc baggie. Just in case if any of it spills on my flight down there. I don't want to deal with that mess. Okay guys, so now I wanted to show you what I brought in the way of makeup. I forgot to film this video before I left, but um, I have some time right now, so I thought I would share that with you. So I'm just going to probably, I'm not going to go over every single thing because you guys know I brought a lot of makeup. But I'm going to go over um, a few things that I brought in particular um, that's either really important or that I brought specifically for training.
Okay, so the first thing that I love is this Park Avenue Princess. This has a bunch of different bronzers in it. So this is what it looks like, and it is amazing. It's so creamy and buttery. Um, so this is definitely a travel essential for me, and that's my Tarte. I brought... The Morphe times Jaclyn Hill palette. Love this thing. This is an amazing palette and great for travel because it's really lightweight and nothing it can break because it's kind of like a durable material. Let me see if I can put you somewhere. Hopefully this is a little bit better of a setup even though it's kind of dark in here. So those things are essential to me. And my makeup bag that I brought just looks like this. I've shown this to you guys before. I got it from um, TJ Maxx. And the brand is Tender Love Plus Carry with a Y. Okay, so two more essential products for me that I had to get before I go was stuff to kind of make me look awake because during training, you, I personally don't get that much sleep. Sorry, my, I don't really know what I'm doing with my hair. Um, so this was something that I had to get. This is the Becca Under Eye Brightening Corrector. I used to use this a lot back in the day. But it's just a peach tone peachy pink um, under eye corrector to help with any darkness that you have under your eyes so I lightly put this on underneath my eyes and then I'll put my concealer on and it just counteracts any darkness that you have under there. I also got this <coughs> Becca Instant Complexion Refresh Primer and I've seen a bunch of people talking about this and um, it's a purple tone so it kind of like counteracts and refreshes your skin to make it look like you're not um, tired or it like kind of gives it some luminescence back but it's not a luminous primer that's not what I mean just like it's really hydrating and really refreshes the skin so these were two things that I had to have with me and I am obsessed with them like I use these every single day and it really helps me make make me look more awake and it's just something really helpful if you travel a lot and you're always tired or if your skin just looks like it needs a refresh I would definitely recommend trying these out I only brought two foundations and um, they are the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte and the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. This is in Golden Beige and this one's in 105 and I brought 106. So these are the only two foundations I brought but I love mixing them together. It's a great combination. For mascara, I brought my Lancome Grand Dois Extreme Mascara. I love this stuff. It's really good at getting at the base of your lashes and the Essence... What is this one? Sculpted Volume Mascara. So I brought these two mascaras with me, and I'll use them both in the same sitting. I like to apply this one first and then go in with this one. For a highlight, I brought the Laura Geller Gilded Honey. This is my all-time favorite highlight. I don't usually highlight my cheekbones, but I do like to highlight the bridge of my nose and, like, underneath my brow. It is definitely my favorite highlight. It just has this golden shade to it. And then the last few things that I brought were lip combos. So I thought that I would venture out a lot more with my lip combinations, but... I really kind of stick to the same thing. Um, a lot of girls did wear red lipstick a bunch when they were in uniform and training. These are two, the two that I brought. This is Lime Crime Red Velvet. This is a really pretty blue undertone one. And um, what that means is it's not going to make your teeth look yellow, which is really important in my opinion. And then the next one I brought is the I Love Sarah He Collection by ColourPop. Um, this is an ultra matte lip in the shade Ariba. So these are my two favorite red lips, but like I said, I don't really venture out with that. What I usually wear every day is the Milani Amore Matte Lip Cream in the shade Adorable, and then I recently got it in the shade Stunning, and I really, really like that one too. So that's kind of the basics for the makeup that I brought. So now you saw the toiletries, my makeup, and honestly, everything that I need, even if I overpack, fits in this bag. If I try, if I can find it, I'll try and leave a list in below. But um, if you see any of these at TJ Maxx, it is the best thing in life. I really wish I would have gotten two. But um, hopefully I can find it online for you guys. So I hope that this video helped you guys. For those of you who are going to training or just for those of you who are traveling, please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And I will see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye.